I can see it, I can practically taste it. There is nothing that compares to pressure cooking when it comes to infusing flavor. If your mouth isn't watering yet, and I don't know what's going on with the taste buds, because you cook this and it infuses the potatoes and the vegetables and that pot roast that is literally, it's not even fork tender, it's spoon tender. It's falling off the bone in what is the most popular size for you or anyone who has ever picked up a pressure cooker in the history of QVC, six quart. Because you can put a huge pot roast, you can put two chickens, you can do so much chili and so much stuff with this, you're not gonna believe it. But what are we offering, Meredith Lawrence, that we've never, ever done before? From Cook's Essentials, our number one cook brand in the history of QVC. This is a huge story. Huge story. In what is, and I know you love cooking, you're the blue jean chef, but you also have great taste with I leaving things so out on your counter in your kitchen. You want it to look aesthetically pleasing well, as well. Well, you know, you only use appliances that stay on the counter, so you have to make sure your appliance sounds good, looks good, and it this one is beautiful. It's stainless steel and colors. Here's the value story of what you are getting with our today's special value. It is only here, and it's a big, big deal. This is a 90 $3 value. Nine, and that, we have had pressure cookers that are six quarts that have been well over $100, $120, 130 I've kicked them off. I, I remember <laughs> it. I mean, 20 years. The glass lid, an extra glass lid that turns this into a slow cooker as well. 40, did I say 40? 40 recipes. It's a $105 value. Today's special value that is not a misprint. Welcome to Cooking on Q Day, your comfort style food day. Four easy payments of six. $16.24. Not only is it the best looking pressure cooker we have ever offered, not only is it the lowest price in the six quart, but this is also such a colorful, yeah. beautiful, and easy to use pressure cooker. Here are your color choices starting right up top. You have that beautiful green, right? Mm -hmm. Down below, this is the turquoise. That's so very cool. I so think. very yeah. cool. <laughs> very but cool. every one of these is going to have that wonderful stainless steel throughout. You're going to have the digital display up front that's as easy to use as your microwave oven. This is the brand new to QVC Spice. Never been offered before. Great looking. These two I want to put next to one another. One is the red, the other is the cinnamon. All right? The red is very, very popular already. I'll tell you right off the top. I don't think we have an advanced order on this. So if you're looking for it right now, the red and that cinnamon are here. And that's the good news if you're considering it. Up top, we have, it's purple. We're calling it eggplant. Give it a little food zhuzh there, that's right? That's right. It's the eggplant <laughs> purple. We have the classic black. All of these will coordinate. If you love this brand called KitchenAid, yeah. uh, these will match beautifully with red cinnamon black and right up front is the cobalt blue look at size look at small footprint but i gotta tell you the stainless steel makes this I, first time i saw this i said this is gorgeous everybody in the host tsv meeting today's special value meeting saw this said the same thing it looks great we did the guess the price thing Everybody thought this was going to be over a hundred dollars. Well, you know, it they, looks like a hundred and fifty dollar appliance. Not only do you need to keep your appliances that you're going to use on your counter, but everybody's always in your kitchen, so they're all going to see the appliances that you have. So you want to make sure the appliance looks good. That's fantastic. But more than just a pretty face, this is a really, really excellent pressure cooker that's easy to use, saves you time, and just creates delicious food. That's the key. The delicious food. There's only one catch: is it easy to use? We're going to show you right, right now, now how it is after we give you this 45 second little montage of what's going on with our today's special value. Brand new and only here at QVC. Only here. Pre-programmed functions. You know like the popcorn function on your microwave? Exactly it's as like easy to use as your microwave. The browning function so you can sear meats, sear beef, sear that chicken and caramelize so those, those, yep. those, those wonderful uh, roast beefs and a six quart capacity. Most popular for a lot of reasons, right? Oh, absolutely. Six quart capacity. You can, we've got two chickens. I'm going to pull two chickens out of one cooker here yep. to show you just how much you can do. You the can glass do lid is usually an extra charge. Only here, it is a slow cooker as well. You can delay it so you can start that pressure cooking later. That's cooking right. a third of the time and three times the flavor. Keep warm function, so you're not going to burn it. So it stays the perfect temperature Put it right on your buffet time. table for your right. holidays so that we can keep all that food warm for the longest time. Why can you do that? Because it's so good looking. Because it's so well. good looking. What if you could cook in a third the time and have even better flavor?
even better flavor. How simple is this to use? Prove it to us right well, now, let please. Me, let me just take you a walk through this machine here okay. because we know that it's beautiful. We've established that. Here's the tour. Here's the lid, okay? The lid mm. has the pressure limiting valve here. That means you're either going to set it to close or set it to open. Ultra safe, That's ultra simple, right? Absolutely right. Safety valves inside, so you don't even have to worry about a thing. You turn it on, you set the time, you walk away. This whole machine looks after everything else. Inside this pressure cooker is a removable insert. This insert has nonstick on the inside. That is perfect, right? This is all you have to clean. Easiest to use is now the easiest to clean. Easiest to clean. I'm as trying well. to think of way reasons that people wouldn't want no, this. There's no reason. There's no reason. I'm telling you, the one reason that I tell everybody to get a pressure cooker is yeah. because it creates excellent, delicious food. By the way, as you're shopping right now, I just want to say this is Meredith Lawrence. This is also the author of Comfortable Under Pressure. This is a cookbook available. It's a different item number, but you want 125 ideas to go along with this. She loves pressure cooking and the flavors, and this is a chef who loves it. Keep on going, please. Okay, well, here's one of the recipes from that book, actually, and it's so simple. It's just taking the corn, the corn that's so delicious right now, Good. and putting it in the cooker. Now, you see, if you look right down in here, I've got a little ring of foil. That's just a little tip for you all. If you want to make a rack for your, your foods, throw a little piece of aluminum Cheap foil little rack. You got a rack. So here to we add go. some space. And here's what I did. I put some butter right inside the aluminum foil with the Ooh. corn. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh yeah, sun-dried tomato. Basil Show me butter. how simple this is to so make. Put that lid on. The lid is so go. easy to put on because it has a marker here. Love this, unlock. everybody. Watch this. Unlock. Unlock. Lock. You put, you match it up, and then you turn it. So that That's there it was easy. unlocked. Unlocked. Now it's locked. Now it's locked. Can, now. can you do that? That was simple. Exactly. Now let's program this. Then shall we? you just turn this so that it's in the in the uh, airtight position. Very simple. And then here's all you do. You go. Wait, wait. Oh, one, two, three. Start. That's that how many it? minutes? Three minutes for <laughs> pressure steamed corn. So delicious. You press start and you walk Seriously? away. Because now what this will do is this will come to pressure. When it has come to pressure, then it will start that countdown. When it has finished cooking, it'll beep six times. You'll hear it. And it will go into a keep warm stage. So it's so easy. So simple. The best looking pressure cooker we've ever offered is also the most popular capacity six quart. And it's the lowest price ever. Ever. Let's go to the phones. Rhonda from Oregon water. is joining us. Please I just do. The water. Hello, Rhonda from Oregon. How are you? I'm great. How are you? We're just really excited about this. It's cooking on cue, a 24 hour event, and it's all about delicious, nutritious, flavorful, rib stick and comfort food. What do you think of our today's special value? It is absolutely phenomenal. This is my fourth pressure cooker. Wow. And yeah, we love our pressure cooker food. We wear them out, so this was perfect timing. <laughs> okay, let me ask you. This this woman loves pressure cooking. First of all, what do you love most? For people who don't yet have a pressure cooker, tell everybody, tell America about the flavor of the food. The flavor is outstanding. You can't beat it. I mean, and it's so simple to use. Mm -hmm. There, There's no mess. Cleanup is easy. I mean, you can't go wrong. This is the best kitchen appliance I have. Best kitchen appliance you have. Okay, this is her fourth. America Rhonda is listening. Nailed it, yeah. Rhonda from Oregon, you just nailed it. Have you not seen digital pressure cookers for well over $100 in the past? Oh, easily, yes. So what do you think of the six quart for, for four easy payments of 16 bucks? <laughs> it's a steal. It's a steal. It's a steal. What color did you get? I got black. Here's your classic oh, good black. For you. Very classic. 40 recipes coming along with this. Enjoy, enjoy stainless steel and black, best looking pressure cooker without a doubt, easiest to use, safest, and man, oh man, oh man, dare I say lowest price. Rhonda, thanks for kicking off our 24 hour event, okay? Absolutely, if you're on the fence, get this item, it's Le the best. It's your fourth. Rhonda, <laughs> thank, thank you, Rhonda. you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Leave it to you, leave it to her. <laughs> to bring that up and to clarify why this rocks and why yeah. it's fantastic. More food, I'm more gonna food. I'm going to show you. So let's go back Here to that Here we go, everybody. Roast. I just want to explain We to just passed the 1,000 mark. No, 1,400 mark. Wow, look at that. Just now. This is going to be one of those hours. I'm telling you, there's no advance order on this. If you want your color, midnight's a nice time. Now, what did you make here? Well, this is, Look a, at this. this is an American pot roast or an Italian pot roast, which means I just put some tomato in there and some Italian herbs How long in that there. Take? How long that take? That take 55 minutes. Now, usually a pot roast on the stove or in the oven, you put that for three, four, five hours. This one is 55 minutes and you're done and it's good. So you can think about this. Think about going to, to church, going to that PTA meeting, whatever yeah. you're doing. You could get this going, go do that, come back and it's done. It's in a keep warm phase. But when you say the, it the Italian or the American, whatever you want for your vegetables, right, or your sauce, Absolutely. it's infused it's into the pot roast. In it's infused. So, so infusion cooking right. and pressure cooking is the 
same thing. It's a third of the time and more flavorful. So Absolutely. you usually don't get that. Like, well, like usually it's like 19 hours and then I get my pulled pork, well, you see, here's right? The thing, Rick. You know, like people look at this and they think, oh, this is a new modern gadget. You know, so how could it possibly give me great food? But that's not the case because our grandmothers had pressure cookers. They had those pressure cookers because they were making such great food with I'm them. I'm telling you. This but is, now we've made it digital so that it's even easier to use. Nothing can go wrong and you can't mess it up. If you can use a microwave oven, you can use a pressure cooker. You just lock the lid on and just follow oh along. 40 Recipes is going to teach you exactly how to use it. Meredith's cookbook is very popular as well. Here come ribs. Look at this. These are done in 12 to 25 minutes. Right, and that 12 all to 25 <laughs> minutes. That really? That all depends on how well you want your ribs cooked. But look at this. This, look at that. That's look just at the that. bone just fell right out of there. Look at this. Look so at this. Falling off the bone. This is, this is live TV. This is not like a, I don't know, cut and paste kind of internet you know, or, or, or <laughs> trick photography thing. This is all live, and that is... Look at that. That is me. You got it? I'm, that is melting, I'm telling you right now, that's melting the mouth. Those ribs are ridiculously good. They're, they're so good. Everybody, and so here's eat what the I do. ribs at the end of the show. <laughs> the ribs are so good. So in the winter time, you know, oh, I cook the heavens. ribs all the way through. You cook them in the barbecue sauce. So oh. the barbecue sauce is infusing into the rib flavor. So you, so the rib flavor is infusing into the barbecue sauce. It's so mutually happy in there. It's fantastic. But it's mutually happy. In the summertime, what I do is I might take them out of here and throw them on the grill for just <laughs> oh, a second. Oh, good. And then boom, it's done. Like that is 25 So minutes. you could see. Them and then, but you throw the sauce in there, and there's 12 minutes, and they're done. Absolutely, absolutely. Oh my heavens, that's, that's so good. Thing. So remember, this is not a funky new gadget. This no. is our grandmother's pressure cooker, made more modern, so that it's easier to use. We, Nothing can go wrong. I'm sorry. We got Vicky, who's one of a lot of people dialing in right now. Comfort food like never before. Best looking, lowest price, by far ever. Vicky from North Carolina, thank you so much for waiting. How are you? Oh, I'm doing great. How are you? I would have spoken to you a minute ago, but my mouth was filled with <laughs> spicy ribs. I hope that's okay. And I got something to tell you. Mine would have been the same way. You would have been. You would have said, I ain't talking to that guy yet. I got ribs to eat. I'm not I talking to Rick. we be on together. <laughs> what color did you get? What color did you get? I got the blue. Yeah, not, not, not the turquoise. The... Uh, Cobalt blue? Yeah, you got the cobalt blue. Not that it matters what color you get, because it'll look great in your kitchen. It will. But no matter which one you're getting, man, oh, man, oh, man, does this thing work? What well, do I've you... been waiting for this. Yeah. You've been waiting uh, for this. For a long time now. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, and I can't wait till I get it. You've got I'm to, telling you, you, you got to have yourself a pressure so cooker. Easy. Yes, ma'am. What have you been waiting I mean, for? What have you been looking forward to, Vicki? Well, for me, first of all, it's uh, digital. Yep. The second thing is y'all have like a um, fail safe. Fail safe. Yes. On it. Yes. There's nothing you can't you can't do wrong. We'll show you that in a second. Okay. And uh, the pressure cooker. I mean, I, when I decide to eat, I want to eat then. I don't want to wait. <laughs> right. You know? Yeah. This is fast food. It's slow cooking done fast is what it is. Slow food. Yeah, and I like how the meat falls off the bone. It, it I guarantee you yeah. it will. A third of the time, and I would say at least twice the tenderness, twice the juiciness, mm. twice the tenderness, that, twice that, the juiciness you know, in a third of the time. I gotta That's tell you, cooking. Vicky, when I was writing my cookbook, I was uh -huh. giving pressure cookers to my friends and trying to convince them. It just took them two, uh -huh. like one or two meals, and they're like, "I can't believe I lived without that thing." Yeah, what was and I now doing? They use it all the time. What was I doing? What was I doing? Vicky, thank you so much for getting your blue in time. Okay. Thank y'all very much for talking to me. Bye -bye. Have a good night. Thank okay. You, Vicky, thank you. Okay. Bye. Bye, Vicky. Love you, Vicky. Awesome. We put this thing. You said, boom, boom, boom. Three buttons. Right. Now we're almost done. Well, this one is done. It's been sitting here waiting for us. That's what I'm us. saying. So this is waiting for us. It beeped. So here's it how beeps you, when it's done, right? I'm hoping there's a little steam left in here, but here's how you release the steam. You just turn that knob, and the steam comes out the top. That's how easy it is. You can see it's not super hot. I can run my hand through it. That doesn't mean that you want to go in there and, you know, put your face right in the steam. But, but the steam's coming out. The steam's coming out. It's no problem. And inside, we have that beef and mac. Do you remember the beef and mac I made? So, so during anything goes, mm -hmm. at about 11.30, about 11.40, we, uh, Meredith put the beef and mac inside. 
right? Yeah, I and did. said, well, we're going to cook this. We're going to make this happen. And when she did, she put it in. Now it's done. And, and as soon as the steam is, is, is dissipated, right? Right. Which it is doing right, right now. now then you can unlock, right? Exactly, and, and what I did with that too, Rick, was I put dried pasta in there. I don't know if you noticed that, but I put the dried pasta right into the beef. And so the, you didn't cook it first, then I put it in. I did not cook it so first. So it is truly one pot cooking. Since so many aspects of this, it's one pot, go away, set the timer, you're going to work, and you can set the timer to start so that it's done by 5.30 when you get home. Exactly, and here it is. The steam is all out. I can turn it now. Unlocked. Now, just so you Here know. Here comes the beef and mac, everybody. When By that way. lid is on, you cannot unlock it. Now you know, Vicki was asking about safety features. You yeah. cannot take that lid on if okay. there's any pressure inside. That's a huge safety feature. Let's talk about this dish. Because this dish is uh, one of the most popular, one of the most requested, and it's in the book, right? Oh, this is in the pamphlet, actually. In the everybody pamphlet. gets well, this. Well, that's what I mean, 40 recipes that you're getting with this. That's you're right. You're getting, this is one of the 40 recipes. Now when it's done, now you add that cheese because it's ultra hot and mm. it's infused mm. with that great cooking. We, remember when I said 800 people have dialed in and then I said 1,000? Whoa. Make it 3,200 people who have made their choice. 3,200. Uh, I'm going to try a little bit of that yeah, in a wait. second because that's going to be wait. hot. <laughs> Come on over here to the colors because yeah, I'm going to show everybody their colors. What is going on here, everybody? Um, well, first of all, I've got that rum and raisin rice pudding. There's some more, my, don't worry. My grandma used to make rice pudding, and I love my, my late grandma, Domeyer. And I'm sorry, you beat it. You know I'm sorry, long? Grandma. I'm sorry, Grandma. But this is. Do you know how long? How long? 13 minutes. 13 minutes 13 for rice pudding. Minutes. You can sit down for dinner and have dessert made for you when you finish. Here's your cobalt blue. Here is your cinnamon. Next to the cinnamon is the red. So that you can see these side by side. KitchenAid lovers. Cinnamon red. Very, very popular. 3,500 people have made their choice. Easy to use as a microwave oven. The Turk. All right, it's stainless steel, but a big, bright, beautiful, fun color. All of that is stainless I love steel. That color. It looks great. Leave this out on your countertop. Totally. Six quart capacity is the number one size. Mm -hmm. This is a huge story. Green already at midnight. Most limited, no advanced order on it. If you're looking for that pop of green in your color, if you have, you know, kind of burgundies and golds and olives in your home, totally. that could look nice. Totally. This is a spice color. Do you I love, love that one too? Do you love Temptations, by the way? And Temptations Very in spice and yes. in some of those beautiful colors. Uh, you know those beautiful colors that are in your home. This is big and bright and beautiful. It's purple. We're calling it eggplant. Mm -hmm. And then you have the classic black. By those the way, everything. this is really. As 1,200 people have dialed in the black, let me just give some love it to the black. It is so beautiful. Because this is a gloss black it, with that stainless steel. You can see the reflection in this thing. It, it, it looks like, well, let's do the graphic on this again, everybody, because we're 17 minutes into the show. This is such a conservative estimate for a six-quart stainless steel pressure cooker, $93. Good luck finding that. The lid is another 12. That is $105 retail value. So just doing the conservative estimate there of something that you can't even get anywhere else, 105 bucks. Here at QVC, $16.24 to bring this home and try it out for 30 days. Call it 30 meals. Yeah. Call it 30 comfort meals. You're getting 40 recipes in the pamphlet, in the little cookbook, 40 of them. You could try a recipe a day for 30 over days. Over a month, yeah. Over a month, if you're not completely like, ooh, that was good, you send it back, no questions asked, no problem whatsoever. What are you doing now? Well, this is another really, really popular thing to do in a pressure cooker, and this is pulled pork. Okay, so here comes football season. Oh, my god. It goodness. just started last night. I was riveted, loving the games. Way to go, Vikings, Eagles. There were so many great games. Look Seahawks won. You want to do that? Shred that for How me? long does it normally food? take to do pulled pork Oop. like in a slow cooker? Well, pulled pork can take hours. In a slow cooker, you're looking at at least eight hours. But then, eight hours. Yeah, so, so this what we do is we actually cook that pork butt in the barbecue sauce right in there. So it infuses with that flavor from the very beginning. Is this going in here? Yep. So this is with the sauce. Here comes the sauce. How long again? This one was 45 minutes. 45 minutes. 45 minutes. So and before the pregame show is over, before and the people even get there, your pulled pork is done. And you can do pulled pork tacos. Your pulled pork tacos, or you can everybody. Do pulled pork sliders. Are done. Pulled pork sliders. And then once you've shredded it all, you can leave it in here. It finished. goes right into a keep warm Look at this. stage. And you've got your glass lid. You can just put your glass lid on, serve it like a buffet server. Everybody comes over, grabs their own slider. Pulled pork slider. That makes a happy really? football crowd. It's midnight. Guys, <laughs> is there any kind of... <laughs> Go, Rick. Mm. Now, Rick, the whole day is about comfort food. Sam Adams or Yingling Lager nearby. <laughs> well, um, please, please work on that and give me the game as well. That was so good. Easy. You would not know that that was eight hours or 45 minutes. It took 
Not a third of the time. No. That's a fraction of the well, time. Absolutely. I mean, you talked about slow cooker, right? A slow cooker would take eight hours. This wow. took 45 minutes here. So that's mm. what you can get. You can get those cheap, cheaper, more flavorful cuts of meat. Put them in here. And can we get just show the really top of this? I don't know if we got the overhead shot of this. But you put the stuff in there. Right. You put the barbecue you put the, sauce. You put in. the barbecue sauce, and then you just uh, you just time it for 45 minutes. Right. You put you punch in 45. You press start. 45 and, and then start. Right. And the that's it. And the recipe you get right there in the booklet as well. So Man, everybody's that, gonna that's get that. Just, that's just. And it's just easy. so worth it. It is so worth it. For, one, for just a couple one of meal. dishes, I'm <laughs> telling you, it's worth it. That's worth 16. That's worth an easy payment right there, because it's it's like going out to right. eat. Absolutely. For you and your family yeah. of four, six, right. try to go out to eat with a family of four for 16. dollars But you know what? Rick, you just made how many pounds of pulled pork? This is six quarts. It's not a family of four. We're talking <laughs> a family of eight. Right? We're talking a yeah. family of eight. And by the way, you can remove the bowl inside and save it for tomorrow, or the next day, or the next day. And now, with your 125 recipes. In Meredith's cookbook, comfortable under pressure, right? Absolutely. Now you're getting gourmet with this thing. Now, what the heck did you do here? So, I've not seen this one. So this is my latest recipe, and you can find this on my QVC blog. If you go to the QVC blog, you'll see this. And this is a spinach and three cheese manicotti. Spinach and, and three, three cheese, cheese manicotti. manicotti. Yeah, so you don't even have to cook those manicotti noodles first. You stuff it that. when they're nice and rock hard and easy to stuff, and then you put it in here with the sauce. When it's hard, the, the, the manicotti is hard. It's hard. Everything's in there. Hard and you, uncooked. You put it in there, and how long does that take? Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Ten minutes, and then you do it. You put the cheese on. You put the lid back on while it cools because you know it's too hot to eat when you first. Too hot it now. Up. You might. You'd be okay, I think. Are you okay? Oh, Barely. Well. Does he need water? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somebody's still working on that yingling. But, but the so moisture. Good, right? The moisture. The, the moisture in the food. I the know. steaming and moisture that's infused in the food. If you have ever had, you will never have dry, tasteless food no. in your life again. No. It's almost impossible you with know, a pressure Rick, cooker. You know, that is easy. That's made with frozen spinach and some ricotta cheese and some Parmesan cheese and and raw. Oh my noodles. heavens, that's good. And easy to do. Easy to do because look at those control the control panel. The control panel is so simple, right? There are buttons here that are like your my, your popcorn button on your microwave. Oh, you want to make beans? Just hit beans and then start, right? But here we've got chicken cacciatore, and this is really going to speak to how big. This cooker really Six quart is. capacity is the most uh, popular size because people can do small jobs, some, you know, small dishes, or they can put two big old chickens in there, like whole chickens. And the one problem you're going to have is getting it out whole. <laughs> the only problem is, is that it falls off <laughs> because it's so tender. Watch this. Look at that. The, the leg and the, the leg thigh just still, fell off. It's still in here, yeah. It does because it's so tender. It's full, and but but the but the flavor has been infused. So whatever kind of spices you put in Isn't have now been delicious. infused within the meat. So it's almost like you're, um, you know, those those injectors. Yes. It's almost like you're doing the injector without having to inject the food. Absolutely, you're absolutely right. Or it, marin there's no marinating. It's it's the ultimate marinator. Because this stock that's left in here, this sauce is full of chicken flavor. So you're getting not only chicken that's full of the flavor of whatever you put in there, the wine, the stock, whatever you're cooking it with, but what you're left with is delicious. This. And you can use what you're left with to make soups, to just throw some noodles in here and I gotta going. go to Kathy from Wisconsin who's joining us right now because Kathy's been waiting and Kathy is having fun tonight. Hi Kathy, how are you from Wisconsin? Hey, I'm doing really good. Um, I'm hi to, hi to both of you. Hey. I can't wait to get this thing. I'm oh. so impressed. Oh, oh man, that, that manic I made she made manicotti. <laughs> she made rice pudding. You're gonna make uh, pulled pork, eight hours of pulled pork in forty-five minutes with this thing. Do you have a pressure cooker yet, Kathy? No. <laughs> this is it. This is the one. Easy to use as a microwave oven. But you, what color did you get? You get the black? Yep. Black. Look at this thing. Looks like a looks it's like a, a it is a piece of work. A yeah. showpiece <laughs> really in your kit. You're gonna be proud to show this off. What do you wanna make with yours? Hey, I'm interested in, like, I, I saw those ribs. Yeah. Oh, bro. The ribs are, you're done. You, yeah. Ribs could be first. Ribs, done, good, quick, delicious. How long do the ribs take? The ribs were 25 minutes. 25 minutes. Before the Packers kick off, <laughs> your ribs are going to be done, Kathy. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you hey, love that's it. Great. That's great to know because, um, I mean, like, the six quarts, I mean, I, 
I live alone, and I just think this would be awesome for myself. But well, you know what, Kathy? Let please. me tell you something. It's a lot easier to cook a small amount in a big pot than it is to cook a big amount in a small pot. So you cook little so, dishes as well. And you know what I do? I often cook for one or two. I will make a, a, a decent amount of food, and then I freeze it. Yep. And then I've got meals for a week or meals for two weeks, and it's yeah. fantastic. Yeah. Or just meals for that time I don't feel like cooking. Indeed. And it's there. And you know what you can do? You can stick it right in here and heat it up in there. Heat it up because it's a slow cooker as well. It's definitely a slow cooker as well all in one appliance because you got the glass lid with it so kathy thank you so so much to, for dialing in from the great state of wisconsin okay okay thank you bye bye thank you here's what you need to do keep watching because in a little bit we're going to show you some of the most requested desserts mm -hmm. some of the most requested desserts that you can make with a pressure cooker so you think it's pot roast it is you think it's stew it is you think it's uh pulled pork absolutely you think it's going to be the most delicious ribs you've ever had it is, but there's desserts coming up in a few minutes, so keep on watching. I will let you know that if you're a fan of QVC and you love QVC, you can use automated ordering. It's an easy way to try us right now, like a lot of people must do, because we're very busy on the phones. 1-800-345-1212 gets you in with your major credit card. You can also text your order. If you're newer to QVC and you're just saying, man, oh man, what's that? I'll have you, some you know of what? that. You gotta smell this. You gotta have you gotta, that. Can you smell this? Then just be patient. Do you know what that is? Wow, is that like a goulash? It is. It's a Hungarian goulash. It's a Hungarian goulash. And, and now, th th this is a recipe. What's the heart of the of the of the, of the sauce to make it well, Hungarian? Well, you put a little caraway seed in there and some paprika in is there. Is that what it is? Yeah, and it's delicious. And it, you, you can do that in a pressure cooker in 18 minutes. And then what kind of beef are you using there? Well, that's just stew meat. Stew just stew beef, meat, yeah. right? So you can do that in, in uh, eight about eight hours in a slow cooker. If you have all the time in the world, you put it in here. You put it on slow cook for eight hours and you walk away, right? You leave that glass lid on it. But again. But if you want it fast, do it in 18 minutes this with a pressure cooker. Nothing like the beef on the other one. In other <laughs> words, in other words, the, the, all of the sauces are infused, Absolutely. and all you do is you throw them in. So, so, so much about cooking that is a hassle for people like me is the timing, the layering, oh, yeah. when to add the ingredients, yeah, no. when not to, bring it up to boil, bring it up to heat, and bring it down. And you know, don't overdo it. Now it is, it is literally. Foolproof. It is foolproof. And you know what else I like about it too is that it's a helping hand in the kitchen. I got stuff on my stove. I got things in the oven. This you got is, kids or this dogs? This is sitting here You're by walking itself. Away over on the counter yeah. doing a whole bunch of work for you. You can be doing a side dish if you want to, or you can have a side dish in here while you have your turkey in the oven. Gotta you let can you know so much. that if you're looking for the black, if you're looking for the red, if you're looking for the most limited green, midnight is a great time to be shopping for your color, whether it's fashion, whether it's uh, jewelry in your particular size, or in this case, whether it's the color mm. of your six quart digital pressure cooker. The price on this is the lowest price we have ever offered for the most popular size. So that's a hit right there. Absolutely. You got most popular size, lowest price ever. And I could see $64, uh, candidly, I could see if this was a less than aesthetically pleasing, but we really got the value story. You want a less right. expensive one, right? right? But this is the most aesthetically pleasing, best looking, yeah. prettiest, dare I say, pressure cooker that we've ever offered. Now this is something that you're just gonna wanna do. It smells so good. This is breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack, Anytime. This is rice pudding. Right. This is this a is rum raisin. Rum rice pudding. raisin. How much rum are you putting in the rum raisin? You know, enough. Enough. And uh, we, uh, there are recipes for the rice puddings in this the booklet, and heart. there are more recipes for rice pudding now, in the book. Eat, I could eat that. This is not the low fat. No. I could eat that whole thing right now. <laughs> it is so delicious. You know good. what else you need to try? You need to try this because you can also put vessels like this. It's a little ramekin. This is a caramel pot creme that we made, like, which just means a fancy word for pudding, right? Caramel pudding that we made in here. You wrap these little ramekins in foil and you stack them in you here. You put them in here. Try that. Oh well, my God, that's better than the rice pudding. Hello. What is that? That's a caramel. What do they call a caramel pudding? Is that not really, really, that's really, really good? Really. Yeah, I know. <laughs> is that I in your book? Yes, that's in the book. I haven't Ooh. warned any host about the caramel pudding. That is gram. crazy it is good. good. It's smooth. It's um, soft. It's, it's oh my God, that's the greatest dessert so I've ever had. That's to tell you that if you have, t you know, pieces of temptation. You're going to teach me how to teach my wife how to do that. Piece of temptations in here. All those pieces <laughs> of ceramic pieces of metal, all those cookware pieces you have. Oh. If it can go into an oven, it can go into your pressure cooker. You just need to get a rack, but again, oh, you saw me good. use aluminum foil to do that. Pace myself. You gotta see the cook times. Okay. So we, we, we told you about the cook times, but here are a lot more. A third, a third of the time, and twice the tenderness and twice the flavor. What? Boneless rib roast. Yeah, traditional cook time, about 33 minutes per pound. This is half that, 15 minutes per pound. Uh, rump roast, round roast. 
30, no, it's 12 minutes per pound. It's a third. Ham, bone in, right? 22, no, seven to nine minutes per pound. Whole chicken, boneless chicken breast. Look at boneless chicken breast. They're done. Look at them and they're done. Pork tenderloin, eight minutes, not 20 minutes. Turkey breast, a third of the time and it's done and it's more tender. So pork is going to be more tender. Because remember, we're not sacrificing flavor when we actually save yeah, this on is, time This is here. the anti-microwave oven. This is not like a new gadget, like pressure cooking's new on the scene. It's not. Our grandmothers use pressure cookers because they work so well and created such great food. All we've done here is added that great color, made it digital so that it's foolproof, put safety features in there so nothing can go wrong, yeah. and then made it beautiful enough to sit on your counter. So really, this is a, a modern day, great way of cooking. And I think that... Honestly, I used to tell people the essential things you have in your kitchen are knives and pots and pans. I'm adding pressure cooker to the list. No question about pots it. Pots and pans, good knives, and a pressure cooker. And, and it, it can it, help you in so many ways. And my, my wife's objection was always, you know, the safety difficulty factor. And now that we've tried this, that objection is gone, daddy, gone. We are the busiest family in the world. No, we're not, but we feel like we <laughs> are sometimes. Are. Yeah. Uh, with two kids in multiple sports, this is done and it's real food. How many times have you gone to fast food or pizzas or burgers or just like because you need it now because you don't know what to cook? You can now do this. You can actually cook from frozen within mm -hmm. this pressure cooker. It's the most popular size. It's one pot cooking. Let me go through the colors and what's going on here. Because over how many? 7,000 people have now said most popular size and lowest price and best looking. Yeah. Throw in easiest to use, really? Here's the cobalt blue. It'll coordinate with KitchenAid. It'll go on its own. This is the one you're proud to keep on the counter and show off. Mm -hmm. Remember the tube TVs that used to hide, then you showed the flat screen because you want to show it off, <laughs> yeah. right? This is the, the kitchen appliance that you don't want to hide, you want right. to show off. Behind that is the black. Very classic. You know what I'm going to do? Could you do me a favor sure. and put the blue behind? Because I want everybody to see the black right up front. Because baby, this is the black, and this is the one I wouldn't want to wait on right now. It's gloss black. This is perfectly coordinating with kitchen. You know, it goes with everything. So if you're buying it as a gift for somebody Amen. and you don't know what they want, that's great. the one. Great, great, great. You know, wedding gift, all yep. that kind of stuff, yep. right? And look at the stainless steel. This looks really rich and really expensive looking, right? Mm -hmm. Cadillac story. Mm -hmm. Two reds. One's cinnamon. the cinnamon and one's the brighter red. I'll put them together so that you can kind of uh, clarify. This is a separate purchase. It's Meredith's book. It's really popular. There's 125 great ideas and photographs and so much more. I'll, we'll get into that in a second. Up top here is purple. We're calling it eggplant. That's how you would order it with automated ordering. You're getting the lid as well so we can focus on uh, um, slow cooking in just a little bit. And these are the three fun colors they on the other fun. side. Yep. I mentioned temptations and spice and all those kind of things that you may have in your home. This is the spice color. We're calling this green because it's green. Yeah. Uh, but it's, it's cool. It reminds me of like almost like a bit of a retro kitchen. It is. A retro kitchen green. That could also go with old world and temptations yes, as absolutely. well. Absolutely. And this is the turquoise. Fun, so fun. bright color. Yeah. Green now most limited. No advance order on this. You Here's know, the value story. Now let's talk value from you as a chef, as someone who shops this stuff. This is this is your world. Under a hundred dollars. When I can't tell you how 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 short a time it's been. When I kicked off pressure cookers I in the know. past, they were 125 dollars I know, I, I actually, it perplexes me court. too. I don't understand what's happening. What happened good. there? $12 <laughs> for the glass lid. Take the glass lid out. It's still $93. This is a $105 total retail value. Four easy payments of $16.24. Julie from PA is joining us right now. Hi, Julie. Hi, Rick. Hi, Meredith. How are you guys? Great. Thank you. We're doing really well. We, we love this. So am I. What do you <laughs> think? What, you, toy. <laughs> what inspired you? What made you hungry? What made your mouth water just a little bit? <sighs> Well, you know, it, it changed since I've been on the phone. I mean, I, I, I have an organic vegetable garden, and mm. I want to make stews and all that stuff out of it. And then I see the goulash, and then I saw the, the corn demonstration that you made with the, with the corn in the foil. And uh -huh. oh, Now you're making wonderful. my mouth water because I'm thinking, what about... <laughs> What about uh, heirloom tomatoes and well, stuff? You can absolutely. You can go ahead oh, and make absolutely. your marinara make my own in here. Marinara sauce, sauce with heirloom tomatoes. You're, you're, I'm dying. This is it would be great. Yeah. Yes, yes, absolutely. And I love the fact that you can use cheapo cuts of meat and make it really tender. I'm all about fork tender. I am not a chewer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're not I, a I'm chewer. With you. Well, you know the history of pressure cooking was based on exactly that. Our moms and dads. <laughs> No, truly, yeah. our moms and dads didn't have teeth. internet access and five Cadillacs and four cars. They bought cheaper cuts of meat. I thought you were going to say they didn't have teeth. Absolutely. No, I said they didn't. 
I love the fact that you can brown in there. That's one. That's wonderful. Oh, you, you know. can brown. See, because before what a, what a the other that is, you'd have to go and get a separate pan to brown it. Now you can brown it right in here. You can as well. That's, that is that's a lifesaver right there. That's, what a time saver that'll be. Very and good. Dishes, and, and washing dishes as well. Well, one so, pot yeah. to wash. Right? Great point. Just Great that point. one insert to come out, and that's the only thing you have to wash. So half a third the cooking time and a third the cleanup time. That's absolutely. And then and then I have something I can you can use it for canning. Yes, you, know, you for can. anything I want to can out of my garden, everything. Yeah. Now absolutely. you're selling me on the thing. Got got it? Yeah. yeah. What color you getting? Yeah, yeah, what well, color am I getting? You have to go and buy one and they have easy pay. Enjoy the black. Thank you so much, Julie. <laughs> Thanks so much. Thanks. Bye bye. Nice, nice talking with you both. Thank okay, you. nice talking with you as well. You're a joy. Please. Rick, I just also want to show people how easy this is to store as Please. well because it's going to be sitting on your counter. But you see, none of these actually have those plugs on them. The plugs come right out of the machine, so we haven't got the plugs here. But you put the cord right inside, you invert the slow cooker lid on top, you place this on top like that, and then it sits on your counter, no problem. It's pretty enough to keep out, so keep it out because the more you have this on your counter, the more you're going to use it. And once you start using it, I'm telling you, you are not going to stop. Winter, summer, spring, fall, you'll be using it all the time because there's always something good to put in here. There's only one problem we have. What's that? This thing cooks so fast that we've already gone through like 52 different recipes. <laughs> How many can we possibly show? We have We're 25 minutes to go uh, in the show. Uh, we want to remind everybody what's happening. Let me go through the, a, little, a little call out of some of the features that you're going to be getting with our today's special value. Okay, 41143. Meredith, help me out. Sure. This is, we're not pulling anything back on this one or taking no, anything no. away. We've got 11 pre-programmed functions from steaming, browning, slow cooking, just putting things like meat or vegetables in or, or beans. We also have a browning feature there because it makes a difference to the food. If you can brown it first, we don't want you to have to pull out a separate pan to do that. So you can brown right in here. You can also steam in here and it has a six quart capacity. That is a big chicken we've pulled out there. You just saw me a little bit earlier pull two three pound chickens out of this pot. So that's perfect. And then for those days when you have all the time in the world, throw the glass lid on and do slow cooking or put the glass lid on when you're keeping things warm. And then if you have something to do later on closer to dinner time, so you want to do the dinner now, do the delay timer. The delay timer will have things start in, you know, three and a half hours or whenever, and then you can just go ahead and, and come home to a beautiful meal. We're back to QVC. It's live, always live all the time. It's midnight. It's a 24-hour event, and the 24-hour event is called Cooking on Q. So we have 24 hours. We got great uh, offers on QVC.com for the entire day as well. We have the star of the day called Today's Special Value. It's one item, and this bad boy is it. It's a six-quart, most popular size, pressure cooker. Yeah, and look at this. This is the browning feature I want to show you. Because some people say, well, can it really brown? Like, does it really have the power now, how to brown? Do you, how, do you, how do you turn it on to do that? Well, there's a button right here, and it says brown. You press brown and start. <laughs> that would be the way to do it. Like, how easy is that, You press the brown right? button, and then you press the start That's button. That's how easy it is. So when you are making, this is just a classic pot roast we're going to make here. That looks really, so now it's caramelized. Now right. it's seared. Now, great flavor on the outside. So it's not only going to make the flavor good, but it's going to make the appearance look better, too, right? Yeah, Everything yeah. Everything looks better when it's a little brown. Okay, now you're starting from scratch. So, so watch this, everybody. A little cooking class here. So easy. You know, if I was doing this at home, I'd brown all the sides. We only got one brown there, but that's okay. okay. So then we add all of our vegetables. These are the vegetables that we want to flavor that food okay. with, right? So we want some carrots. Some Can I put a little salt on there? Please, go right ahead. Put a little salt, put a little pepper a little on pepper. there. We're going to throw those potatoes in, too. I'll put the potatoes in. Now, you don't, you don't cut the potatoes? You don't do anything? No, no, you don't cut the potatoes. We want them in bigger chunks because they're going to be in there for longer. Big chunks of potatoes. Nice and soft. All at the same time? All at the same time. Now, what's the sauce you're putting in here? That's just a little red wine, a little bit of stock. Good. Then, did you season it well? I did. I Maybe a little more yeah, salt. There you go. Oh, yeah, you're like a little burst. Okay, great. <laughs> and now you put the lid on. And here we go, everybody. Little. Keep watching, keep so watching. Remember, with the lid, you've got the, the <clears> little uh, padlock here. You're going to line the padlock up with the unlock. So it's, it's basically impossible to do it wrong. And then you turn it to the Like lock. it doesn't turn on if you right. don't put it on right, right? Now this little feature here is something I just want to tell people about. It, it looks very loose when the pressure cooker is cold. Okay. And some people say, hey, they've written to me on my Facebook page and said, is my pressure cooker not right? It's going to be loose when it's cold. When this actually gets hot, then it becomes very, very stiff and firm. So don't worry about it. We have that on the airtight position here. And all we have to do is go ahead and set that time. So I'm going to Now how you going to set that? Watch this, everybody. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to say, I'm going to hold it down until it gets to 50 minutes. And then when it gets to 50 minutes, I press start. That's how easy this is. Okay, 50 minutes. Now that gets up to pressure. And then once that gets up to pressure, then 50 minutes later, 
that's it done. Counting down, right? And then it goes to a keep warm stage. So even if you're not home, well, once food, it's off, it goes right? to keep warm. So even if you're not home, you can go ahead. I just, just look at this. It. How about that? Just right over your that's face. Really that's nice. really nice. That's really nice. How about 2,400 people have picked up comfortable under pressure? A lot of people picking this up, and that's 120. I, I promise you to show you this. 125 recipes with photos, and by if it's Meredith. She's going to give you great food, interesting, interesting food, delicious food, but then step-by-step -step instructions as well. Everything from seafoods to classic pot roast to sloppy joes to chicken breast with oranges, peppers, and basil. Doesn't that sound good? It's done in minutes. So all the cooking charts are here, chili con carne, all there. Feel comfortable in the kitchen with your pressure cooker. That's part uh, of an additional purchase of our today's special value. I'll put it right over here on the stand and come back to you because here's what we're going to do. We're going to take a break in a couple minutes, but first we got to show oh, yeah. this, this is a basic, right? This is we're talking about comfort food all day today. This is mac and cheese. It's made in six minutes, Rick. And you put the water in here. You put the pasta in here. You don't even need to drain it. You just add the cheese. And it's done. What's the Six. difference then? What's the difference from like putting it on the stove? Well, for example? here's the thing is we're not waiting for the water to boil. We're not waiting for the pasta to cook. We're not making a cheese sauce over here on the side and then adding it all together. Mm. We're putting it all in here and we're just letting it be. No, right? also the, the pasta is so tender. It's so tender. And you know what? It's infused with all that great flavor. So, it is. I mean, it, easy, easy. That is a great weeknight meal for a mom, a busy it's mom. Done. Boom. Kids Small boom. dishes, big dishes. We got Jane from Texas who's joining us right now. Good evening, Jane. How are you? I'm really good. Well, you sound really good. You sound <laughs> like you're, like we're making you hungry here. You are. Yeah, we're doing basics. We're doing classics. We're doing like some crazy things as well. And there's so much that it, one of the most imaginative uh, appliances I think you'll ever have because you can do so much with it. What made you dial in for it, Jane? Well, I had the last one I had still went on the stovetop. Uh huh. I went for the safety factor on this one. Yes, yeah, so and the, the only thing fashion. I haven't heard while the demonstration is when it's done cooking, what is the release time to be able to take the lid off? Great. So we did it once. Maybe we can do it again in a little bit. Uh, but you basically, when it's done, it beeps, right? Yeah, it beeps. And, and you know, your release time actually, Jane, depends entirely on how much food you have in there, so how much pressure has built. If you have something with a lot of liquid in there, and you're gonna have more pressure built in there, it's gonna take longer to release it. But usually it. like it's what, a minute? Yeah, I mean, I have- A minute and a half? Yeah, here, I mean, at the most, I would say, at the very most that I've ever experienced in my life, two or three minutes. Two or three minutes, that's but, it. But yeah, but and that's otherwise, done. No. Then the pressure's off, lid's off, food's done, Jane. Yeah, does the pressure give you a signal? Oh yeah, so it beeps once when it comes to pressure, so you know that now it's going to start counting down the time you put in. Yep. And then when it's finished, it's going to beep not once, not twice, not three, six times. It's, it's a microwave beep oven. Six times for it you beeps when it's done. You. Then you and let then the pressure out and it's done, Jane. Hey. Hope you like. I can't wait. Thank and you. I didn't order her book, but I'd like to do that, so they need to send me back. You just stay <laughs> in the line. We have the technology to make that happen. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Jane. Bye bye. Good evening, thank you. Good evening to you as well. Here's what we're gonna do. We're coming back, we got, I think, about 15 minutes to go. And a lot of food to show, uh -huh, still. Uh -huh. We'll see what we can do. Uh, okay, 41143, let me give you the update on today's special value in the colors. We just passed the 9,000 mark. This is beyond what we thought this was gonna be, and I'm not surprised, I'm really not surprised. With the look, capacity, price, and results, we're coming right back, right after this. Cooking on Q Day continues. for the book.